party people today's video is going to be a tutorial on this look right here this i believe uh is the look that i had on in my haul my first haul video quite a few of you guys asked for a tutorial on the look i was wearing in that video and this was like i'm pretty sure this is what it was i went and looked back i don't think i had lashes on in the video but I just put some lashes on today for shits and gigs because I got some lashes and clearance at work and I was like, I might as well use them, right? Right. So, if you guys want to know how I did this going on right here, then let's go and do it. Okay? Okay. All right, y'all. Here we go. Ratchet ass nails. Let's ignore that. Base and brows are done per use. First thing I'm going to do is take the Becca Brightening Concealer. I'm not really sure what it's called, but it's that thing. And I'm going to take it under my eyes. I just put this on with my finger and rub it in, apparently really roughly rub it in, and then tap it in with my finger. Next, I'm going to take my LA Girl Pro Conceal and put that in all of the concealer places or highlight eel areas, if you will, uh, under the eyes, nose, lip, and chin. Then I'm going to blend it out with my Beauty Blender, and my Beauty Blender's wet. So, uh, that's a thing. Wet beauty blender. Usually it's dry and dirty, but this time it's wet. Just going to grab the other end of my beauty blender that I use for foundation and blend all that together. Now I'm going to take my NARS Translucent Crystal Powder and with my beauty blender, take it and kind of push it into the skin and set all those areas that I put concealer at. Next thing I'm going to do is take my uh, Smashbox Bronzer in the color Warm Matte and with a Bare Minerals uh, Flawless Face Brush, just use that to dust around the perimeter of my face. Pre-warning, this is literally the shortest tutorial I think I've ever filmed. It goes real fast. It's about my fifth attempt at trying to voice it over. So, contouring Dolce de Leche by Wet n Wild. They're going to take this to cut up the old cheeks because, let's be real, it's the holidays and mama needs all the contouring she can get. For blush, I'm going to take Warm Soul by MAC and dust that on the old cheeky old area. I don't know why everything has to be eel and areas and such, but that's what's up. So, highlight Becca Moonstone with an e.l.f. blush brush. Going to do that highlight thing right here, right now. That's what's up. Do you see that? Yes. That's a fucking highlight. And I already did one eye just to save a little bit of time, you know. So I'm going to grab my Makeup Geek palette and go into Confection and on a Morphe M441 just dust this in the crease, staying right in the crease above the lid. Now I'm going to take Petal Pusher on a 433 and just do, um, not do, no, put that a little bit tighter into the crease and like I said before, kind of staying off the lid because I'm going to be doing like a soft cut crease type dealio. Then grab the 441 again and just blend that out. Now I'm taking an e.l.f. shader brush in the color Sorbet and putting that all over my mobile lid, the movable part of my lid, and using that Sorbet to kind of clean up that uh, cut crease, if you will. Then taking Cherry Cola by Makeup Geek. I don't have a clip for this. I don't know why. Apparently I was too lazy to make one at this part. And, oh no, what was that called? M562, that's what that brush was. Then grab an M443, why the fuck do they have to have all these crazy ass numbers? Lord and Barry Pencil and Maybelline Eye Studio to make my wing. And this was completely out of focus, so there's that. We're going to go ahead and skip over that though, so just wait. Now, with the M562 again, and Cherry Cola again, you guys know the deal with my tutorials. I like to get my eyeliner down first, because I got what you call hooded eyelids, girl, and it helps to show where my crease is when I do this. I don't know why I'm Southern all of a sudden. Then grab the 433 again and blend that out. Always want to blend down with one, or lay down with one brush and then blend out with another. Curling up the old lashes with my Tarte Eyelash Curler right here. Now I'm going to take my Maybelline Lash Sensational. Y'all know this is my ride or die for my upper lashes. 
Then I'm going to go ahead and slap on these lashes that I got at work for $3.49. They were on clearance. They're called Enchanted Elegant Lashes by Ilar, and they look like this. I do like these lashes, though. Then I'm going to take my mascara again and just blend my flossies with my railsies. Now with my NYX Wonder Pencil in the color light, I'm going to go ahead and pop that in my waterline. I hate putting liner in my waterline because this shit happens. Ooh. It's like crazy, crazy burn. It's a good burn though, right? Then I'm going to take the Lord and Berry pencil again and go on my bottom lash line and take Cherry Cola and just go on top of it with this little flat shader brush that I got at Kohl's. Then I'm going to grab the 444443344444334, whatever, you get the drill. Then taking Lancome to Finicils and popping those on my lower lashes, not those, just that. This is like the fifth time I've tried to uh, record this voiceover and I'm not doing it again. So this is what you get, people. <laughs> This is the Steel Liquid Lipstick in the color Bossy or Bocci, B-A-C-I, not that you saw that. And I'm going to go ahead and throw that on the old lips really slowly. You would think this was slow motion, but it's really not. This is just how long I take to put liquid lipstick on. Real fucking slow. Real slow. Better get it right, girl. Better get it right. <laughs> Then, once everything was done, I realized I forgot to highlight my inner corner, and what kind of a fucking makeup look is a makeup look without a fucking highlighted inner corner? Am I right, girls? So, I took in the spotlight and highlighted. Now it's done. So, this is the look. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you have not. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, or Snapchat, if you please, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace!